my YouTube tutorial this is ABM graphics and today I just want to show you how to create a DFD Photoshop using images yes and this particular destiny is that you know a whole lot of people have problem in that you know you can't after creating anything on Photoshop you can save it as PDF but what of if the that particular thing you want to save is images maybe you scan your documents or you just take a picture of your documents and you want to do you want to a, maybe you just want to match all into one like one in all you can have all in one document and you want to maybe you scan your documents about 20 and you want to add all in one listing one as a one document how do you do that in photoshop so first of all let's just come to our photoshop just like this and for this particular listing this is pdf file and this is pdf what for over here you can just go to file come to save as and then you can save it as pdf from here you see that you can save it as pdf and it will save here what of if those things you want to save are images like there are images like this 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 how do you do that in photoshop so and then this one you can add more this thing to it and it will look so beautiful you can add more of your documents 50 100 photoshop will do it if only what you need to do is to tell photoshop that i want to create i want you to create these two images as pdf save it as to a as pdf for me and photoshop will listen to you and it will do it yes so how do you do that yes the next thing you have to do is to come over to file go to automate and then you click pdf presentation then you click ok and you can have it the older versions too is the cs6 cs5 or cs4 you can get this particular function there you get that yes and then after that you come to browse when you go to browse then you select any image that you want to use for that then i'll just select one and no let me make this one one and this one two so it means that if you are doing it always make sure that it is in line maybe you you have to save it from page one page two page three page up to any page that you want to do and then when the pages are not full you can say sort by what name it will sort by name and then the save as multiple page is okay background should be white fonts should be 12 and you select note two and then after that you click save then when you click save it will now ask you where do you want me to save it and then you can tell it that okay save it on my desktop and they will ask you give it a name then you can say my documents you can say my what my documents and then you can do what you can say save then when you say save this sub this will, will appear for you to just do adjustment to it but if you don't want any adjustment to it just click save us and wait for photoshop to do that so one is saving like that the next one that one will pop up this one and that ends the problem it has saved it so you can do this for 500 images just at one and photoshop will just do it very fast you know you don't need there's a one man asked me to do this kind of thing and he asked me to use coral draw to keep putting it saving keep putting it i said oh you are wasting my time this is a whole lot of the photoshop comment cannot be there whilst i'm doing this kind of while away you just need to tell photoshop create this as pdf and it will create it for you so let's just open it up and let's see what magic photoshop has done you can see it it has done it and it has even saved it uh, in a list yes this is page one and this is page two you get that yes and you can use this to do a whole lot you, you know 50 hundred uh, of a uh, list of documents just save it as images and you can do what you can create a pdf presentation to it and to do that for you thank you very much for watching this is abn graphics have a nice day bye bye